So a feature on the PlayStation 5 is finally being added. It's one of my most requested features, and we're going to have a little talk about the update today. Let's get into it. What is up guys, welcome back to yet another brand new Major Ben gaming video. This is probably going to be a pretty short video today, but there has been an update recently or there's going to be a major update, sorry, which is going to be 7, uh, 7.00, which is actually going to include full Discord support, uh, which is just, oh, you don't understand how good that is. Like from someone who was uh, uh, plays Xbox a lot as well as my PlayStation and my brother's a PC player, I can just use the Xbox party chat and connect to a PC with him and Xbox party chat on PC, or I can already use Discord to jump into one of the Discord chats uh, with him on PC. But with PlayStation, if I want to play a, play a game on PlayStation and cross-platform with him on PC, there's currently no way for me to talk to him that's convenient in any way. So they're actually going to be adding full Discord support, which is not just a little bit of Discord, this is full Discord support where we're going to be able to chat with our friends or, or, or family or whatever and uh, actually have it as the app where we talk to people i can actually see it replacing the built-in playstation chat because discord is really good a lot of you if you don't know about discord or you haven't used it much it's got some of the best audio that you like audio um quality transmission between microphone to microphone that you will actually get in a chat service it's really 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 high quality so as reported by Insider Gaming, the major firmware update is currently scheduled for March 8th, 2023, with a public uh, beta slated to arrive in the coming days. However, the beta will not include Discord integration for testing and will instead presumably focus on the new ability to stream PS5 games via the cloud. So this is the other section of the update. PS5 games are now going to be able to be cloud streamed. Um, for exclusive members to obviously PlayStation Plus Premium, which is the most expensive tier. I don't know why that's uh, a feature right now. Maybe it's something that where you can stream it to your phone. I don't know. We'll have to take a look when the update actually drops. But that's something else that they're adding along with this update. But this is obviously something that's not coming until March 8th. But I am still very, very excited. It's perfect timing for various different titles where we can play cross-platform. Uh, well, actually, Skull and Bones now, which is one of the ones I was kind of looking forward to a little bit with playing multiplayer with my brother, has now been delayed. So... Who knows? But this is seriously cool. It's great that they're finally implementing this. This is something that fans have been asking for for such a long time, and it's just needed. Like, again, there's no way to talk with your PC uh, friends. There's no way to talk with them. Um, you know, obviously, as I said, the, the Xbox does have the party chat option, and now you also, there's a way that you could talk between PlayStation and Xbox as well. So you'll be able to not only just talk with PC people, but you'll actually be able to communicate between both consoles. It's kind of bringing people together, especially for very large multiplayer games like Call of Duty and stuff. My friends are all on different platforms. I got some on Xbox, I got some on PlayStation, some on PC. Like, it's really nice that we're going to actually be able to communicate together in a very simplistic way via Discord and play games together that we may not usually have played because of things like this. Uh, same with things like Fortnite. You obviously, and, and Warzone, you use the in-chat game system, which now is really bad for Warzone because you've got proximity chat and you can hear people around around you. But second of all, it doesn't work a lot of the time. Like it cuts out during menu loading screens and stuff like that. You can't hear each other. It cuts out at random times. Like it's just really, really badly. Like the in-game chats are really, really bad. So it's something that you don't want to rely on. Um, and having your own Discord little group just going to be so good. I'm hoping we get a lot of the PC features as well that we have, where we actually have our groups and our servers. Like, I have a Discord server down in the description. I never really talk about it much, but I do have my own Discord server. It not very much goes on there. It's something I want to work on in 2023. But um, I do have a Discord server, so it'd be cool if I could interact with you guys on a more personal level through the Discord server on my PS5. That's something that I want to see how they integrate it. I I just really hope it is going to be full integration like the PC. Like we're going to be able to like press the PlayStation button here, for example, go down to where our normal party chat would be and actually see a list of our Discord stuff as well as the PlayStation party if they're going to plan on keeping that, which I imagine they will. Be cool if those were merged, like you just use your gamer ID and uh, like let's say my friend is online the same party chat that I would have here, but except it just runs through Discord. Like, that would be really, really cool if when you log into PlayStation, you automatically log into Discord as well. Like, I think that would be something that I'd really, really like. So I don't know how that's going to work. I'm interested to see it, but that's it for this one. Very short video. Just wanted to talk about the update and there's PS5 game streaming as well if you're interested in that. But main thing here is Discord coming on March 8th. I'm excited. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye for now.